So as a part of first experiment, now we will go for the second subsection that is integrator. So integrator we have the standard formula v not equal to minus 1 by r into c integration from 0 to t v i into dt. Here v i is input, v not is output, r and c values we will be varying to get the different output voltages. We have the formula to find out frequency f equal to 1 by 2 pi rc, f is we are assuming 1 kilohertz, choose any valent value of c that is 0 0.001 microfarad, then r equal to 1 by 2 pi f into c, r value will be 15.9 kilo ohm, nearest standard value is 15 kilo ohm. Now observe the circuit diagram here, we have used op-amp mu a741, pin number 2 is inverting terminal, pin number 3 is grounded that is non-inverting terminal. From pin number 2 to 6 we have connected a capacitor of 0 0.01 microfarad and according to our design R value we have taken 15 kilo ohm and the input is given from the signal generator that is 2 volt peak to peak 1 kilohertz signal. So for a input of square wave output should be triangular wave. In the same manner we have connected the circuit diagram here. So here we have used open and a 15 kilo ohm resistor 0 0.001 microfarad capacitor and the input from signal generator 2 volts 1 kilohertz pin number 3 is grounded and we are checking the output at pin number 6. So now if I observe the output its channel number 1 for input square wave and the output is <coughs> triangular wave. So wherever for the rising end of the square wave so we can see the falling edge of the triangular wave because in the formula we have seen v not equal to minus <coughs> 1 by rc. So for the complete one square wave one triangular will be observed in the output waveform. So same thing will be repeated. So we can get the different triangular wave by varying the value of r and c.